Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and somebody emailed me and wanted to know how they could make like a firework exploding, like a sparkler type deal. And this is easy and fun, and this is how I would do it. There'd be many ways to do it, but if you'll take the Pentagon tool, Polygon tool, and let's make it 15 sided and hold down the control button. Let's move this out of the way for a second. And then let's go up to Edit and Clone. And then move our clone out of the way. Now let's zoom in here. Let's Control D and make a duplicate of it. And put one of them right there. Go back to our original, make Control D. And the reason I'm going back to the original, because if you go... If you make a control D now, it's going to move that one, and it doesn't really matter. But just kind of put them different places. And now take your control polygon, get your shape tool, and take one of the nodes and just move it outward. Now take one of your inner nodes and move it inward, and then kind of move it to the left, give it a little bit of twist. And you're basically done. Let's get this out of the way for a second. Select all this. Weld it. Take your Smart Fill tool. And fill it in. And you could play around with that. Um, make different. You know, they, these might be too. Let's go back. Let's make them a little bit smaller. Let's go back to our shape tool. Let's bring in this point a little bit. Make this point a little bit smaller. Select them all. Weld them. Get your Smart Fill tool. Fill them in. And then I would definitely left click so it won't have an outline. And now you just have well, you could do it two ways. I would just delete this. And then this would be your engraved pattern. And, you know, play around with that. Uh, you know, move them different ways. You could always back up. And um, anyway, that's how I would do it. Be a neat effect. Anyway, hope that helped them a little bit. Thank you for watching.